Hi, I'm Adam Drake, and today I want to talk about the process or the steps needed to running your engine in after the piston and sleeve has been resized. Now, depending on who did the resize, they may have different recommendations, but this is what I recommend for anyone who has a piston and sleeve resized by me. When I do a resize on a piston and sleeve, there's a few things that I take into consideration. You have to realize that this engine, if it's worn out or low on compression, it's got a lot of time on it, which also means the connecting rod is gonna have a lot of time on it. So I like to inspect piston, sleeve, and rod, measure the rod bushing, and just see where the engine's at before I determine how tight to resize the piston and sleeve. You don't wanna resize the piston and sleeve too tight if the rod is worn, because then you have all this additional compression, which is also gonna put more stress on the already worn out or worn connecting rod. So after I do that, I resize the sleeve. If you sent me just a piston and sleeve, I send it back. Um, if it's a complete engine, I will also measure the carb settings and potentially readjust the carburetor with um, the resized piston and sleeve in it. And from there, you don't need to do a full-on break-in process because when I do a resize, I'm trying to slightly increase compression, but the main thing that I'm looking for is to increasing the seal of the engine. So when it's hot, it still has good seal without having crazy compression and extra stress on the connecting rod. So what I would typically recommend is just to rich in the high-speed needle, maybe two hours, with the new uh, or the resized piston and sleeve. And then you can hit the track and just slowly run it in maybe one or two tanks to where you just slowly creep back up that one or two hours back to race tune. But it's not a big process. Um, after having the piston and sleeve resized, you're able to get back to the track, get really close to race tune, and hopefully have a much better, more consistent running engine.